market. A young Purple Heart veteran is joyfully welcomed to Amarillo after serving over nine months in Afghanistan. ABC 7's Kayla Conboy was there for the reunion, and she joins us live in the studio with a priceless reaction from both the veteran and his family. Kayla? Stephen, to put it in one word, Hector Mendoza was shocked this afternoon. His family and other Amarillo veterans planned a special welcome ceremony in the middle of the airport that had passerby stopping to take videos and even thank the young vet for his service. For the Mendoza family, the wait is finally over. After months of worrying about his safe return, Hector Mendoza is back on Amarillo soil. We are all so proud of him. And, um, He's a great young man serving his country. Veterans from all over the panhandle rushed to greet him at the airport to shake his hand and thank him for his service. We do this all the time for all veterans, but this one here is going to be special because he is a Purple Heart vet. Mendoza was ushered down a flag line, given a free steak dinner, and even escorted home by a group of veteran motorcyclists who say they love to welcome home vets because of the way they were treated after the Vietnam War. God bless you, brother. I love you, man. Keep up the great work. Hector's family says having him home safe is a huge weight off their shoulders. Greatest fear, obviously, is getting home safe and sound, um, fighting for his buddy to his life, to his right and his left. Um, but he, he, he stayed grounded. He had a lot of faith in God, and um, his unit did wonderful things over there, and they came back safe and sound. The young veteran says he's looking forward to seeing old friends and eating all of the American food he can get his hands on. It's a different feeling over there. It's, uh, it's a lot different. So being back and just being around people that uh, actually are like, they care about you, it's, it's a good feeling. Mendoza says while he is glad that he's back in the States, he will miss those relationships he made with his brothers overseas. I hope that all the rest of my brothers that came home got at least uh, something like this because they all deserve it. Hector says knowing that people back home are rooting for him and his unit is what gets him through the long days of deployment. Reporting live from the Kennedy Broadcast Center, I'm Kayla Conboy, ABC 7 News.